Good morning. This is your government news for Friday, October 11th. Let's check in with our reporters around in the mansion. There will be a call out meeting for girls and boys interested in swimming Tuesday, October 15th from 3 to 4 p.m. in the pool area. Deco is selling Krispy Kreme donuts for $10 a dozen. There are glazed, chocolate ice, lemon filled, raspberry filled, and cream filled. You may pre order your donuts from Miss McBilly in room 240 any day this week. Donuts will be delivered next Monday, October 14th. Attention, Attention all, all students. students. Do you want to improve your resume with community service or volunteer hours? Well, here's a great opportunity to get three hours of community service time and enjoy some delicious pizza. On Saturday, October 12th, HC3 is sponsoring a fall cleanup in Hessville area. We will meet at Freddy's Steakhouse on the corner of 165th and Kennedy at 9 in the morning and end at 12, celebrating our efforts with pizza. Morton athletic teams and clubs have always had a great turnout in the past, and we hope to continue this tradition, demonstrating our involvement in our Hessel community. If you're interested or have questions, please stop by Mrs. Herring's classroom, room 146, and pick up a waiver form. There's, this is a great way to give back to your community. Homecoming dance tickets will be available for purchase during all three lunch periods on Friday. Tickets also available for purchase from Ms. Basil in room 159 after school only. Please bring exact change to purchase your tickets. Due to high volume of students expected there, there will be a limited on admission. Please get your tickets in advance. Remember, homecoming attire must be school appropriate to enter the dance. Inappropriate attire will not be permitted. Attention seniors and early grads, our administrators and counselors will be hosting a financial aid information session in the Morton High School Library on Wednesday, October 16th, beginning at 5 p.m. Please join them and bring any and all questions you have about the financial aid process. Go Govs! Mock trial will meet after 8th hour Miss Taylor Ebert's room on Thursday, October 17th. Feel free to join us even if you missed the call-out meeting. The student government will have a suggestion box outside of room 159 for, for us to give us ideas, concerns, or complaints. So the student government can bring suggestions to administration or our governors come and join student government meetings on Wednesdays after 7th and 8th period. This week's challenge for National Bullying Prevention Month. Make friends with someone you don't know at school. If you ever felt isolated from others at school or you were new at a school and it took time to make friends, you know what it feels like to be left out. Or even if you were never isolated, imagine how it will feel. Be a leader who takes action. Be a Morton governor. Make a friend with someone new. Boys basketball tryouts will be October 23rd, 24th, and October 28th from 3.30 to 6 p.m. all three days. You must have a physical on file with Coach Pio in the athletic office by the gym to be able to try out. No physical, no tryout, no exceptions. If you need a physical packet, please see Coach Pio in the gym area. Do not wait to get your physical done. If you are currently playing a fall sport, you will be able to try out once your season is officially over. If you have questions, please see Coach Pio. There are only two weeks until the end of the grading period. Are your grades where you and your parents want them to be? Don't risk losing your phone, Xbox, or weekend freedom. Come down to the library for study tables on Tuesdays and Thursdays to get help from teachers or even just have a quiet place to get your work done. You can find help for any subjects on both days, but it's recommended that you join Tuesdays for Spanish, English, Social Studies, and Science. On Thursdays, we have teachers who are excellent at math, science, and English. Still not interested? How does a dress down sound? Come to the study tables three times and receive a dress down pass. See you there. October is National Anti-Bullying Month. It is also the month that the PBIS team has chosen to focus on the character trait respect. What a great opportunity to spread support and positivity throughout the governor's mansion. In keeping with the positive theme, the counselors are asking that teachers and students add positive messages to the bulletin board outside of guidance using post-it notes. It could be things like, you are a good friend, be brave, or nice shoes. As the board fills up, students and staff are encouraged to take the messages off the board for themselves and others in need of a smile. Today we have boys soccer sectionals in Munster, and our varsity football team plays at East Chicago Central at 7 p.m. Saturday, you could catch boys soccer sectionals finals in Munster and girls soccer sectionals finals at East Chicago. We also have cross country sectionals at Riverside Park. Here's your lunch menu for today. Thank you for watching your Governor News. Have a great day.